a, a couple of years ago. Like, I don't really care about getting my flowers. I just want to just do sick shit and make, you know what I'm saying, good music, good muse, and just, like, enjoy my life, bro. Like, if I'm sitting here mm-hmm. about what other people think. And I feel like, as well, when I had my daughter, I stopped kind of caring about a lot as well. Like, I felt like, bro, like, no matter what I'm going through, I see my daughter, bro, and I'm just like, I don't even care. Like, you yeah, know, yeah. like that's how I feel about life, bro. Like I don't like it's hard to phase me with really anything. You know what I'm trying to say? Mm. I just I'm just motivated differently. Like she just motivates me every day because mm. you wake up and they're just useless. They just look at you and they can't feed themselves. They can't do anything. And yeah. you're like, you're useless. You actually are relying on me to pattern you. So I have got mm. a pattern. Dave. So I'm out here patterning. That's it. And I don't really, you know what I'm saying? So me, like I'm not here chasing. Uh, uh, validation or like yo cute like I don't I don't need to check what's that gonna do for me or what's that gonna do for my daughter kind of thing like yeah. me saying yo like, I need my I think before like when it was like you know what I mean I felt like yeah like right man needs man's flowers and that like but yeah because yeah, you man used to there used to be a couple yeah, we used to get into, in that yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah we used to get like I mean <laughs> but like I don't yeah. I, gen, I genuinely are like that's why you won't see me saying anything on any really topics about like I don't really, I'm not really bothered. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. like if people like this or like that, like we're just. You know what I'm saying I've just been blessed enough to every time we've given a project, like there's always songs that people gravitate with, or you know what I'm saying. And we've been doing that for ten years, bro. Like, and I'm, I'm grateful for that alone, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Say? Each time, like when when you know what I'm saying when we did from Young Kings when we gave Don't Waste My Time it was like yo boom then we done Long Way Home yeah free career yeah boom mm. you say, then we done seven yeah. days. it's like there's Last Night in LA there's Rumbry there's Wong yeah, yeah oh, boom bangers off the bangers nights, it's wrongs and for me and we had like people's receptive them from Revenge of Sweet it's G Love and I Spy like every single time bro like I, I like I, what, what am I complaining about like, you know what I'm trying to say? Like, I can't sit here and complain about that. Like, every single time we've dropped, like, the, it's been receptive and, you know what I'm saying, we've done six shows off the back of it and, you know what I'm saying, like, what, like, why am I, com- I'm not sitting here complaining, bro. Like, do you know how much things are going on that, sh- that people sh- have more right to be complaining about than me complaining about flowers, fam? Like, mm. I don't care, bro. Like, I'll be honest, like, I just want to, as long as, like, I, I, when we drop this new music and people are like, yo, this is hard, like, and, you know what I'm saying? People are fucking with it. That's it. That's all I want. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not chasing nothing else. You know what I'm trying to say? I just want to do things and, and, and make good moves and positive moves. And you know what I'm saying? I've got my, my door. Like, I'm just gassed. Like, I'm just, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's it. Mm. Man. That's like, bro, nah, like a whole it, new man. person. Like, you know what yeah. I'm saying? I hear it, man. That's, that's um, me, bro. In terms of you and uh, Conan, do you think you guys are the best duo or group to come out of um, the UK? Bro, everyone should think they're the best duo to come out of anywhere, fam, or the best of whatever. If you don't think you're the best of whatever, then why are you doing it? You know what I'm saying? No, no, no but honestly, I'm asking you, though, because obviously with everything that you guys have achieved, in it, Bro, I'm, how long you've you, been... So what, you, what, you, what you think I want to come on here and say another duo is the best? No, I'm just going to ask you, isn't it? Because there might be certain man that might say, you know what, I think no, these men are doing it better than us. No, I feel like I feel like um, everybody plays their part, in it. Do you know what I'm trying mm. to say? I feel like everybody's going to come and, and do something to the best and play their part and help build this whole thing in general anyway. Do you know what I'm trying to say? And, and if you don't feel like you're the best at what you do, then... Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, I don't know why you're doing it. You get what I'm trying to say? But it don't mean you can't rate anything else or think anything else is sick. You get what I'm trying to say? So mm. that's that's how I feel. Like, I just, there's never going to be a time where you can put any person that's uh, and say, oh, yeah, they're, they're wiping the floor with you or they're... Uh, like, you can't tell me that. Obviously, you mm. can have your opinion on that and say, yeah. But I feel like everyone, no matter what it is you're doing, like, you shouldn't... What do you feel like there's other people that have better spaces than you, fam? Nah, nah, no, no way. I'm the the face of spaces, bro. Come on. (laughs) But I promise you, there's probably someone in here that would be like, no, this space is better than your space. And (laughs) it's always going to be like that. So it's just what I just, what my opinion would be any to anyone is just, bro, whatever you do, you're the best, isn't it? That's it. You're the best. No one contract to you and done. Mm. Nah, I hear you. I hear you. 
Um, you know what? Um, I've got two more questions and then I'm going to leave you, innit? Um, in terms of the UK, why do you think a lot of people, they don't do well when it comes to album sales? Smaller. It's smaller? Yeah. Uh, smaller than... Um, we can't compare it to America. America's huge, bro. Like, do you know what I'm saying? Like, if your market is in America, then you're going to sell more than someone whose market's in in England. Do you get me? So, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. And if your if your music is just in England, obviously, if your music's worldwide, then you're going to do worldwide sales. But remember, like, an American that sells bear in America will sell kind of the same what other people sell here at the same uh... time. Do you get what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know, because Coyle Ray, she sold 10k first week. I think yeah, that was probably, probably the lowest. You're always going to get those artists, man. Like, no, 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 no. But then the thing is, over here, we had uh, an artist that sold 9 point something k first week, and they hit a number one. And I think that was the highest, um, in terms of like the rap, from UK rap, that was the, the highest sold um, project this year, yeah. innit? Nine so, who, who was it? I think it was Digger D. Okay. Yeah, I think it 